What is up, YouTube? SK here, and we are still lacking an intro. Sorry about that. <laughs> um, so, today we're going to talk about this this game that I found out about a few days ago, actually. It's called Override Mech City Brawl. And for anyone that knows me, they know I love a good giant mech game. Especially in a city surrounding, destroying everything around you. So, we're going to go ahead and take a look at that trailer right now. Never heard of this company. No schemes. Down I actually like the way these mechs look, though. Yeah, that's pretty. All right. <laughs> is it gonna be? Is, I feel like it's gonna be some rock and sock and robot type deal. Like... Okay. Oh, yo, this has some, like, this has some Godzilla Destroyed All Monsters type of feel to it. Yeah, that's what this looks like. It's like a robot version of Godzilla Destroyed All Monsters. <laughs> yeah, it looks like Bimo from um, Adventure Time. I don't know who that is. What, what, what is this? It's super moves and stuff? Competitive multiplayer. It's like a fighting game version of it. Yo, couch split screen? We haven't had that in a long time. All right. Party co-op. Yo, what are we, Power Rangers now? <laughs> Everybody controls a body part. What is this? That, that, that was pretty dope, though. I, I think it's a cool little concept. I guess that's the generic enemy that you got to fight for, you know, the storyline or whatever. That's pretty cool. I mean, I like this. No gears, no glory. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm ready for this. Like that's, I love mech games. Like when it comes down to it, I've, I've already signed up for the beta. I don't even care. Like I said before, I love mech games. Like, I, though I'm gonna have an unpopular opinion right now, and I'm gonna state it. And whoever's gonna hate me is gonna hate me. But I don't like Gundam. I don't like the storyline. I don't like the mechs in general. I, I just don't. I don't know why. Like as a kid, it, uh, the Gundam storyline never stuck to me. I was too impatient to stick with Gundam, and as an adult, I still can't find my way to stick with Gundam and actually watch a full, you know, a full season of Gundam and be into it. I always get bored and fall asleep or just, like, end up clicking off the video, like, what else can I do? But, um, I do love giant robot games. I love, like, you know, I love Armor Core, I love Zoids, I love the, um, it was a game called Morikumo Renegade Mech Pursuit. And this game was pretty awesome when I was a kid. Like, this was a really old school Xbox, like Xbox, the original Xbox game. Like, you see the graphics aren't the best or whatever, but, like, back then it was something. Like, you just fly around the city in these little highway areas, chasing after these renegade bots or these, like, you know, bounty hunt. Like, you're pretty much a bounty hunter chasing after people that are trying to, you know, do wrong. And you're just blowing them up, capturing them or whatever. And... It, it was a pretty fun game like I, I miss games like this I really wish they'd come out with another game like this but who knows what happened to the company that, that um, bought this up um, but yeah this was where my, my love for mech games kind of started out like this was my first like giant robot game ever and I fell into Armored Core and I fell into Zoids and I fell into you know other stuff like that I never, like I said I never got into Gundam and I don't know why that was This I just didn't have the capacity to take on Gundam at the time, maybe it was because of the politics in Gundam or whatever, but I just didn't have the capacity to stand Gundam as a kid, and I really just don't do it anymore, don't try to do it anymore as an adult, um, but yeah, like, this this, this was one of my first games, I, I love this game to death, I played the crap out of this game, I've beaten every mode on this game, <laughs> but yeah, back to this game, I'm looking at the, the characters right now, and this guy looks like, you know, every freaking protagonist robot hero from every anime ever from every mech game ever that, that's just what he looks like to me i mean he looks pretty cool he has a dual sabers and everything he has a little scarf on the background and then we come to this guy and we know this is godzilla we know this is pretty much mecha godzilla they've got to do they have to do a throwback it's the game looks like godzilla destroy all monsters so they got to throw in mecha godzilla or a form of godzilla in there somewhere and this is where they're doing it and i'm, I'm not even knocking it like i like it this guy looks like some type of Mayan sun god. Um, I don't know. Like his name is Ruka. I might have to look up that later. Like see if he has like some type of origin story behind his name. 
And then, of course, we have the generic ninja mech that, you know, everybody's going to be playing because ninjas are the coolest thing out there or whatever. I mean, whatever, you know, I, I, I don't play ninja mechs, but more power to those who do. I think we saw a little bit of gameplay with this one. Um, she looks like she's like the trickster type, but she has like summons or something like that. I don't know. I mean, we'll, we'll see what when it comes out. And then we got this guy, Vidar, the Robo Robin Hood, pretty much. That's what it looks like to me. But he has like the whole stag thing going on with his horns. So I, I'm I'm pretty interested in this guy too. I don't know who I'm gonna be maining when it, like when the game comes out because I'm probably gonna have to pick a main instead of playing everybody. And then we've got the Grandmaster Shifu because you know they're gonna have their martial arts style character in the game, their martial arts star, style robot. And I'm I mean he looks pretty nice. This design looks pretty cool. Now no one can tell me that this does not look like Bimo. No one can tell me this is not Bimo reincarnated into this game. Like I, I'm. I don't even know what else to put on that. Like, it's either Bimo or that robot from um, Fooly Cooly. That it's one of those two things. Then you gotta have your Egyptian character design, which this was pretty cool. I mean, I I can dig it. I don't know, man. Looking at this thing and reading his bio, this seems like Eddie Goto from Tekken to me, and I don't think that's a good thing. <laughs> Not a lot. I've always had my issue with ice type mechs in games, but we'll see how this goes out. Uh, drop some comments in the section below and let me know what you guys think of, like, you know, robot, giant robot games. What type of, what, what's your favorite giant robot games? And someone tried to convince me to like Gundam because I, I just can't personally find a reason to like Gundam. No one's ever tried to convince me before. So someone tried to convince me to like Gundam and I, maybe I'll give this new one a chance that everybody's talking about Iron Blooded Orphans or something like that. Um, but yeah, go ahead and, um, like, like, subscribe, share. Uh, pass along and peace.